Hey everybody, Kit here and happy hump day. Um, it is time, it is time. Oh, it is time for hope. Oh, it's go time. Um, I got, I got, I got nothing to say, I'm just excited. Um, this one is going to be a bit of a shorter one, I think. But it's go time. I don't care, it's go time. Yay! Generation 3! Oh my god, I'm so happy. I'm so excited. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it. Halfway through the week, we're almost there, guys. Um, and yeah, without further ado, I'm way too impatient. <laughs> the day has crept closer to our baby coming, and Erwin's panic levels reached an all-time high. What would we name the baby? What if we weren't good parents? What if the baby was allergic to Del Sol? What if they came after us? On and on it went. Erwin, baby, relax. We got this. One day at a time, right? That's what all the parent forums said, anyway. Because for all my bravado, I was terrified. I didn't know how to do this. The whole birthing thing or the baby thing. The forums had some scary insights, like ghost doctors delivering babies? What? <laughs> that couldn't be right. No. Thankfully, just as I was there to soothe Erwin's paranoia, he was there to soothe my worries and give me as much back relief as possible. I am a whale and I really, really need this baby out of me. Ghost doctors, C-sections, natural poop shoot, whatever it takes, really. And sooner than either of us were expecting, that time had finally arrived. It's funny, really. I was all ready for this baby to enter the world until my water broke and the pain started. Then it hit me and I realized the pain had only just begun. Ah! 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 Baby! The baby is coming! Doctor! Erwin, dear, we need to go inside first before you panic. Then, once we get inside, I can panic, but I didn't tell him that. Erwin was trying so hard to help me, but he can't help with this part. He just kept crowding me. Baby, baby, just sit here, okay? I'll thank the doctor. Men can't help with this part. It will all be fine. Okay? Just breathe and sit down, and I'm going to go... Have a baby. All right, chat with you soon. Uh, okay, okay, I, I can do that, I can do that, I can do that. Okay, yeah, okay, okay. Uh, 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 all right, I love you, I love you, Hope. Good, good luck, good luck, I, I'll just, I'll just sit here. Okay, uh, good, good luck. I think I saw a nurse hit, slip him something because when I saw him next, he was a lot more calm. Meanwhile, here I was, wishing my mama was here more than ever, realizing just how much my life was about to change. Here goes nothing. The procedure was long, painful, butt-numbing, and altogether very strange. The medication and drugs hit me hard. Is that my heart? Did... Did I die? Why is there a claw going in the machine? Is my stomach open that wide for that thing? Will it fit? Will the baby fit coming out of me? Why, why are there multiple holes in this machine? Um, hmm. I think I hallucinated a ghost doctor, because there isn't. <laughs> that is impossible. Congratulations, Mrs. Brooks. The ghostly echo confirmed what my eyes were seeing. Uh, are you real? Like, like a real doctor? I was, when I was alive. Don't ask, it was a malpractice issue. Oh, oh, lovely. 
But soon enough, I was back on my feet. Our baby was in the world officially, and Erwin was over the moon with joy. And maybe a little bit of calming down medicine. But our baby girl wasn't so happy to be in the world. <laughs> Not like we were to see her at long last. Hello there, little Marin. I couldn't believe it. My baby girl. I am a mother now. I have a whole daughter. My whole little world. Right in my arms. She's so small. So tiny. Mama, I did it. I did it, Mom. I just wish you were here to meet her. My first new boo and her first kiss from her mama. And I get little feet and tiny fists going for my face. Oh, she's a Brooks, all right. <laughs> oh, little one. Marin Brooks. Welcome to the world. I had a feeling you were a fighter. You have quite the set of lungs, little one. I have a baby girl! I'm a dad! Erwin shouted with glee down the halls amongst his infant daughter's screams and my laughter. And just like that, Generation 3 is born. Welcome to the legacy, Marin Brooks! <laughs> oh man guys yay we're getting into gen 3 oh I have to say like there's always something special about it isn't there like um cause for me it's hard for me to stick with save files for a long time and really this the Brooks legacy was my very first attempt at like sticking with a save file playing for a long period of time and I've had it since 2019 2018 really actually um and you know uh this baby Marin uh where I'm at in my game actually is she just had her own baby <laughs> um and yeah, I kind of, I've, I've, like, and I've stopped playing because I have so many photos and, like, I wanted to share their story and it was, like, so overwhelming and I really just, you know, needed to stop and I needed to just start and that's, you know, what we're doing right now. So it's really exciting for me to get back to that point um, and to see her born again. But it really is special to have like your sims kids born and to see them get to grow up and like the legacy passed on you know for the generational players for the rotational players like it's really cool and there's also really a sense of accomplishment so i i've never gotten to gen 3 much less gen 4 um and i'm so excited and just happy for it um even if it takes me a million years i'm i'm excited you know um and hopefully with my momentum and everything i'll be able to get to where i can play again soon and yeah it's gonna be a good time i'm really excited uh but i'm just basking in the accomplishment over here we are officially at uh 21 uh, episodes of Gen 3, Gen 3, what? Gen 2, and Generation 3 has officially been born and started, and, ah, and Marin is also a favorite of mine, so, <laughs> yeah, um, but yeah, so, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this uh, as much as I did telling it and getting to revisit, um, <laughs> not just Hope and Andy anymore. They're growing their own little family and they're starting to have their own kids and I am so proud of them. Isn't it funny how Hope was just a girl who didn't have a big family? Hope? Hope. Or Eden. Eden was a girl who always wanted a family, always wanted to be somebody and even though she's now gone, her legacy is living on and... 
her kids are doing pretty awesome things. So, yeah. And her grandkids are starting to be worn at this point. So, yeah. But, yeah. So, um, enough sappiness from me. Uh, I'm going to go. Uh, again, happy hump day. We're halfway through the week, you guys. And I will see you all potentially next time. Um, and, of course, there will be more Nubu updates because let's be honest here um Lisa's pregnant uh Ho Hope just had Marin um there's just gonna be babies <laughs> from this point onward <laughs> oh but I am so excited for it and I hope you guys are too so yeah and don't forget where the waters grow legacy uh, where water slow legacies grow there we go Blech. um but yeah alrighty guys um, have a good one. Bye.